tonight on Road News. Rising pollution levels in the Thames has caused nature activists to demand change. The UK referendum results has pressurised Parliament to lower the legal voting age to 16. London Zoo shut down after allegations of animal abusement. Hi guys, and welcome to Road Report. I'm your presenter, Curtis Ray Pye. And me, your co-presenter, Jada Johnson. First of all, we sorry, we have some breaking news. Recent studies baffle scientists as dead bodies are being reanimated. We'll get back to you with more information. For the main story today, we'll be focusing on the success of a recent app called Flipper Chat. Back to you, Tin, with more information on this story. Hey guys, I'm your correspondent Tiernan Matthews and I'm here on scene at Chestnut Grove Academy to see what students and teachers think about the new app Flipper Chat. This app is 100% anonymous, so we're going to see what they think. Let's go. I think uh, anonymity on social media is a serious problem because people don't face consequences for their actions. I think there is a problem with being anonymous on social media because no one, no one knows who you are. Like, you could be anyone, you could sort their account and it's just it's just technically dangerous i think this new website is going to cause a lot of problems for young people and for their parents and carers and teachers um, i think one thing we could do is we just really need to educate young people so they really understand perhaps uh, the impacts of online bullying we're now here at the flipper chat headquarters to see what the ceo john small thinks of the new drama caused by his app let's see what he thinks thank you for meeting with us mr small you're welcome so the app flipper chat has skyrocketed to number one on trending how do you feel the audience has responded to the app? I think we've got a uh, great audience feedback. We've had a lot of focus groups, a lot of data has been collected from the public and we've had just positive um, feedback. I think there's, yeah, it's just been amazing. So the app is 100% anonymous? Yes. What's your response to the controversy caused by this? Well, you know, being anonymous allows us uh, what allows the public to freely express themselves and talk about the things that they want to speak about. What are your feelings on any dangers caused by this? Well, there's there's dangers to everything. It's just hoping that the audience will take into account the positive and the negative effects because I, I think there will be a negative things for everything. So, mm. yeah. Thank you so much for your time, Mr. Small. It'll be interesting to see the future of Flipper Chat. Today, we've heard a lot of different opinions, but we want to know what you guys think. For now, I've been Tina Matthews. Back to you in the studio. Man, that app causes a lot of issues. Although I like how people are able to express their opinions. Fair enough. Well, we've heard our opinions and we would like to hear yours. Please feel free to go to our website or on Twitter, hashtag us, Road Report News, and we will try to read all your comments. Thanks, guys. We'll be right up back after the ads. <laughs> 